Hello, my name is Desmond and I will give you the word for today. The word from today comes from Exodus 20 verse 21. The people stood at a distance, but Moses approached the thick dark cloud where God was. When I read the scripture, I'm saddened to see how the people stood from a distance. They could only get a glimpse of God. Had they gone a little bit closer, they would have been experienced more of God's presence. But you know what I love about the scripture as well, is that Moses approached, he ran towards the thick dark cloud where God was. God's glory is so powerful and so strong that God had to be in this thick dark cloud. Because the Bible says that if anybody saw God's face, they would die. So God was in this thick dark cloud. But you know what I think about when I hear a thick dark cloud? I know. I think of thunder. I think of rain. I think of lightning. But yet Moses was not afraid. He ran towards this thick dark cloud where God was. This scripture also reminds me of a reporter. I think of a reporter where he hears about a crime scene or maybe there's a, a celebrity and, and you know how it is when you have a celebrity or crime scene they take safety tape and they demarcate an area so that people can't get there and so you've got a crowd that's watching but they can't see everything they can only see a little bit of the crime scene or they can only see partially um, of um, they can only see part of, of, of that celebrity but the reporter he breaks the rules. You know what he does? He goes under that safety tape. Even when the police or the security is trying to stop him, he breaks through and he runs. Why? Because he wants to get the best coverage. And just like us, as Christians, you can get the best of God's relationship. The reporter wants the best coverage. Don't you want the best of God's relationship? What do I do? I need to be like Moses. I need to be like that reporter. Push through. Break some rules to get close to God. The Bible says when you draw close to God, He will draw close to you. When you have that amazing relationship with God, you know what happens? He will bless you in every area of your life and you will start to see the favor of God in your life. That is my prayer for you today. God bless you.